you find it terrifying? I have found it terrifying. Yes, it's yeah. it's very. I you know I have I had a very profound experience with it in 2017, and I have no real desire to use it again. Yeah, that's my thought too. It's like I'm not going back there. <laughs> Hey folks, Kirby here. Um, great clip. That's Joe Rogan uh, talking with Hamilton Morrison about their experience with 5-MeO-DMT slash Bufo. And uh, I just thought that was interesting that both of them were like, I'm, I'm good. I, I got everything I need from that, that one experience because it was so scary. Um, I'd like them to reconsider. I've used this sacrament over a hundred times, right? I see the purpose in it. Right, as long as it's progressive, you're moving forward. What the, I find that this medicine and the sacrament is doing is dissolving these egoic patterns that aren't serving you. So maybe in one event, one time, and I've seen it where folks can get in there and, and these energetic patterns could be dissolved or removed, but it's usually an ongoing process. It could take two, three, or, 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 or more. But each time I find the experience progressive, I get more information or more of the negative parts of my ego are dissolved or I become more aware of parts of my ego that aren't serving me. Um, yes, it's a scary sacrament for most people the first time you sit down. Again, every time I do it, I have a little nerves. That's normal, that's human nature. Um, but again, the majority of folks come out of it, come out of it with this sense of unconditional love and longing and just the sense that they came home, right? That they came from home, that they went home and are now coming back. God, source, consciousness, heaven, home, whatever you want to refer to it as, that's the consensus for folks that do the sacrament is that that's where they went. How often do you not want to go home? I mean, I, I can go to heaven every day and, and not get bored with it. So for me, a one-time experience is fantastic if that's what serves your needs. But I'd recommend to folks to consider if you need more to do more and it's okay. But for them to not see the purpose in doing it more than once is what I want to address um, because there's multiple reasons for doing it more than once. Again, if it's going to serve you and it's progressive. Again, we already talked about the ego resolution or dissolution of that, dissolving these pieces of the ego that are not serving us. And then again, this opportunity when you come back online to witness your ego separate from it, but witness it acting and playing out your programming. Guys, that's so invaluable to be able to witness your ego and all its craziness, right? Doing what it does. With that insight into the programming, with that perspective and uh, view of your programming, then you can start unraveling that. Each time I do the sacrament, I see more of this programming that I'm then able to go in and unravel. Um, that's a huge benefit. So again, if it serves you to do it once, I think that's fantastic. I'm just picking on these guys because I, I have respect for them both and their their, their adventures with these sacraments and, and, and these medicines. Um, but this one surprised me. One time and done? Come on, guys. There's so much more to this sacrament. Again, I there's so much more, and I'm still curious. So if you're curious, write some questions. Hope this helps.